I knew that I really wanted to get the opportunity to grow and to lead teams and to have exciting opportunities where the work that I'm doing is impactful. I was looking for a place where people were achievers and they really appreciated excellence and wanted to make sure the environment I was working in cultivated that. I think that's partially what, what drew me to consulting, making an impact on individuals, but also you know large companies and being able to do that early on was something that really excited me. Work-life balance was really important to me as well. I just wasn't interested in that life that those big consulting firms were going to offer me. When I heard about Credera and heard that, hey, I can do that same type of work, but I can actually do it in an environment where I get to also, you know, build a life here in Dallas and not have to be traveling all the time. That was what drew me here. I always encourage these young kids, listen, you need to have three lenses to your scope. What will you get to do is lens number one. Who will you get to do it with is lens number two. And the third lens is how much will they pay you initially and long term. As you're interviewing, ask yourself these questions consistently. Do I like the people I'm meeting? Not just from HR, but the real practitioners of what I'd be doing. Can I see myself fit into their teams, working in their team rooms and being a part of their culture? And then the second part is what they do every day, will they like it? One of the biggest things that stood out to me about Credera versus the other firms I talked to is I could tell how much everyone loved their job. It was so clear to me that they weren't just saying, oh yeah, we have core values and saying all those nice things. They truly loved what they did. Every company is going to have on their website that they value excellence and humility, integrity. So it's hard to determine you know, what's real and what's not. I just felt an authenticity at Credera that I had never seen before. In your first year or two, you'll be presenting to an executive. You'll be on the front lines of a real team with real deliverables, with real deadlines and real go-live dates. You'll do meaningful work that you can point people to and say, I built that. We work in highly empowered, smaller teams and the bigger firms, and because they do, they have bigger roles, and they absolutely love that. It's a little scary at first being someone brand new and it's sitting in front of the CEO of you know your client's company, um, but you get accustomed to it very quickly and I think that almost forces growth and that really is the best growth experience. My technical skills have grown tremendously and, and that's due in large part to just working with really smart people. But also mentorship is very important at Credera. But within my first three months, I mentioned to you, the president of our firm, Justin Bell, I'd love to get coffee with you at some point to just learn a little bit about your approach to business development and I'm thinking if I can get time on his calendar in the next three months, that would be great. And so Justin follows up and says, yeah, how about tomorrow? It was a real confirmation that I'm at the right place and that the leadership in this firm, they're living out the values that we portray. Nobody wants a job. People want a career. We have very well-defined career tracks from consultant to senior consultant to manager and architect, senior manager, senior architect, principal, principal architect, both lead to partnership. We're offering that. Why not come change the world and have a career, not just a job?